BlackRock knew Donald Trump was going to get assassinated before it happened. BlackRock bet $360 million shorting a company owned by Trump, ticker symbol DJT. If Trump dies, the stock will plummet and BlackRock will make billions. But Trump didn't die and they convinced their brokerage to give them all of their money back. Because the stock rallied 40%, it tanked their investment from $360 million to zero. The strange thing is the shooter had once appeared in a BlackRock commercial and they took it down just minutes after the shooting. So why is BlackRock sending their mafia after Trump? BlackRock is one of the largest hedge funds in the world. They grew their empire to over $10 trillion of assets under management, which means they own the world. That's enough money to buy the entire country of Mexico seven times. They're even on track to own 60% of the US housing market by 2030, and they have stopped at nothing to expand their empire since 1988, and only one man has stood in their way, Donald J. Trump. BlackRock was exposed for investing $6.5 billion into the Chinese government. This means they took your 401ks and invested them into your demise. This helped them build new weapons that vaporize humans in an instant, aka the vacuum bomb. And they are using all of this new money to finally beat America. Donald Trump saw this and he tried to put a stop to it. So he imposed massive tariffs on Chinese imports. This forced China to hand over $70 billion during the four years that Trump was in office. So how did BlackRock try to hand their Trump problem. This is Thomas Crooks. He was the 20 year old kid from Bethel Park, Pennsylvania who tried to assassinate Trump and he came within a quarter inch of completing his mission. Not a bad shot. So one of the most powerful companies in the world tried to hire a kid to assassinate the former president. Considering that he came within inches of offing POTUS surrounded by the Secret Service and the FBI, they may have hired the best man for the job. In 2022, BlackRock aired a commercial about Thomas's school. This commercial just so happened to star Thomas Crooks, the same Thomas Crooks that tried to kill Trump. Just minutes after the assassination attempt was made, they removed the commercial from the internet. If BlackRock did hire this hitman, they were so sure that he was going to succeed, they bet $360 million on him. So how was Trump's death going to be a huge payday for BlackRock? It was just one day before Trump held his rally in Pennsylvania. Austin Private Wealth bet $360 million shorting Trump's company, ticker DJT. This means they were betting on Trump's company dropping massively in stock price. And the sketchy part about all of this? BlackRock owns Austin Private Wealth. If Thomas Crooks was successful in his attempt, BlackRock would have profited billions of dollars. After BlackRock realized that the shooter was unsuccessful in his attempt, they filed a Form 13F showing that they had only placed a $36,000 bet on DJT stock. Austin Private Wealth claimed that this was a clerical error and they only meant to buy 1,200 shares, not 12 million. But how often do you hear of mass of financial groups making clerical errors like that. It never happens. All of this information we use to trade stocks. From trillion dollar companies to copying the trades of Nancy Pelosi, we find a way to profit. I bet you didn't even know that all of this was connected. That BlackRock was paying China and Trump was getting in their way. The world of geopolitics is messy and filled with opportunities to make money. And I am an expert on finding that opportunity. Some of the best stock traders in our group use this information too and they make thousands of dollars. Like this member who made $30,000 in one week. And this one who made 13,000 in one day. If you want me to teach you how to do this, go to my website, borsfinance.com.